the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Norm is back. And for this King's Legacy video, I'm going to show you how to reach 300,000 HP or even 500 or even 1 million HP, guys. So is this possible? Gamer of that's edited. No, this is real and I'm gonna show you in this video how. Okay, so we are here in the Pirate Island. As you can see, my level is 1,695. So when we transform, into the demon form of venom fruit again guys you can only do this with the dim uh, with the venom fruit there you go our hp is thirty nine thousand, right but gamer Nom, why in the pirate island does it have something to do with the transformation or the increased hp no guys i'm here because i thought that i can make the video here peacefully as you can see i was while i was doing the video my hp is 122,000, right see same level even if you put uh, max defense and power fruit in this fruit or in the stats, you won't be able to reach that. Again, I thought I can train here peacefully, but there's a dragon. The user attacked me. Check the damage. I think that is the V skill. 30k damage. But guys, check our HP. It's legit, right? 30k was damage. We still have 90k. So I tried to run to show him that I don't want to fight because he's going to get defeated. Just joking, guys. But anyway, keep on attacking me. Check that out. He was able to attack me two sets. See that? That's that's another V skill. So there you go. 30, 42k damage, right? I uh, 43. Uh, I mean, okay, I only have 20k HP now. So I decided to fight him. Okay, I'm gonna fight you. And guys, check that out. 6,500 bounty, bro. It's your fault. Check our HP. We still have 20k. So 100k uh, damage, it's fine, right? It's fine. But this is one of the disadvantages of using this fruit. Guys, you cannot be healed. Even if you don't attack. Oh, someone tried to attack me again. Maybe it's his friend. Sorry, bro. You're fighting an awakened venom fruit with an HP of 133,000. Sorry. You won't be able to defeat me. Okay? So guys, Check this out, check the HP. I want you to check the HP. If if uh, you're in a normal mode, or normally you will re re regenerate your HP, right? Check my HP, 13, 13, it's not moving. Try it guys, try to get damage or in the water or try uh, a mob damage you and try to run. Go on top of a safe place and you will increase your HP. But in this situation, you won't be able to increase. So that's one of the disadvantages. You need a friend. You need a friend. Again, here's my stats. You need a friend. So I asked my friend to like heal me. <laughs> a Phoenix Fruit user can be good. I haven't tried what they call this, the cyborg yet, but bro, thank you for healing me. Again, Lelouch. There you go. So I asked him to heal me. It's kind of hard because uh, for every skill, he can heal like 20 or 30k, something like that. There you go, this is fast forwarded. Okay. Okay, so again, one of the disadvantages of doing this is you can you cannot heal yourself. Maybe you can use your uh, cyber again. Okay. So how do you do it? So this is how you do it, guys. Check that out. Transform, you will increase your HP, right? For like 10k. Now check the timer below. When it reaches 9,026, okay, you will re return back to your human form. There you go. Again, but guys, check your HP. It's 39,000, right? So you just need to push your V again, the demon form. There you go. Okay. Boom. 51K. Okay. Now, just wait for the timer. To reach 9026 again just a reminder push the demon form after you reverted back to your human form again if you reach 9026 seconds you will automatically go back to your human form okay uh, there you go 63,000 just do it repeat 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 until you reach your desired HP check that out we didn't change any on our stats there you go Okay, now 75k. Guys, disadvantages again. You cannot heal on your own. Okay, next up. How do you return back? 
Guys, if you haven't reached the time yet, 9,026, and you push the V button. Okay, here we go. You will see it for yourself. Here we go. Check the HP, guys. It returned back to 27,000. So try to watch out for that, okay? Okay, so before we end this video, let me just show you a clip wherein I'm using the Awakened uh, Venom form in the Golden Arena. Just uh, first 10 waves, guys. Oh, you hear that? That's Pandisal or Puto. <laughs> Who eats that guy? Comment it in the comment section. Next up, guys, I will be doing the level 1 new gravity. So watch out for that. Thanks for all the support. It's wave 2. Check that range, guys. Woo! The demon floor. And then use the triple hydra. And then summon the basilisk. Basilisk. Okay, basilisk. Again, if you just uh, click the basilisk, the moment that it cooldowns, you can summon two at the same time. Guys, this fruit really looks so strong, right? In the first, uh, how many waves are we in now? I think first four, yeah. First four waves. But if you're gonna ask me, this is very good in PvP. This fruit is very good in PvP, but in Golden Rule, I think the sword is still better. The triple authentic katana and use magma fruit with it. Oh, or even gum fruit. It's very strong, guys. Okay, so I'll just be uh, playing this until wave 10 because you will see that uh, this fruit will be having a hard time. But always remember that we're just 1,900. Uh, 1,695 in level, so this will become stronger, I mean the defense, and you can also use swords. In this uh, raid, we're just relying on pure fruit. Okay guys, so that will be it. Uh, we'll just reach again wave 10. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you. We've been getting lots of views. I will be making again another video on the Gravity Fruit Awakened level 1 noob. So watch out for that and other rare fruits as requested. So again, this is Gamer Gnome. Have a good day. Oh, that's a cool guys. Gamer Gnome out. It's getting noisy here. Bye-bye.